don't look Indian, we don't speak Tamil. We sometimes people don't know. Eh, you ni Portuguese ke, Mama? Eh? I say, well, <laughs> saya, <laughs> saya Malaysian. I used to say saya nak jati ya, datuk hang tua, okay? <laughs> so, this, this is what being a Peranakan Malaysian is all about. I have my own identity. I speak my language. We have our own food fusion. We we know our rukun negara. We patuh to all the undang-undang. That that's what defines me as a Melaka Jati. My full name is Amu Davadi, but I'm more known as Amu. My family name is Pile, so I go by Amu Pile. Uh, but tapi kat kampung people offer me as Amu Dala, so ada, itu nama kampung ini nama nama bandar kan. Asal dari Gajah Berang, Gajah Berang Melaka, is kampung Cheti. Um, I'm Malaysian, proud to be Malaysian, and a, and a, and a Cheti Melaka peranakan. Malaysia is my home, and Melaka is my tempat 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 darah. I love Melaka. Everybody in Melaka is very friendly. Of course, our bahasa kan kadang kasar, you know. Because when we meet people, lah, how are you? Hidup lagi. That's how we say, oh hi, how are you? Ataupun dah makan. That's. Okay. I've got one pantun for you. It's a bit weird, lah, pantun ni. <laughs> Anak Cina membeli tahu. Alamak, kenapa dia bungkus dengan surat khabar? Mungkin cik belum tahu. Inilah rupa orang cerita Melaka. Even the language, we don't really speak Tamil because, you know, those days you're not so close to your dad, but you're closer to the mom. So to us, our mother tongue is Mal Malay. So, so eventually, you have a family of Indian origin, but Malay speaking people. We came way before British came. So we were here on our own accord. And that's what makes us unique. And that's what makes us where we are today. I think that is quite sad, kan? After 60 years, there are still people who don't know the existence of Melaka Chetty. I mean, like you say, you've never seen the kampong, and it's like it's with, with with the internet and everything. There's still a lot of people don't know us, you know, and and the way they talk about it is like. And sometimes I feel like it's um, discovery of one tribe from the Amazon, you know. <laughs> it's like they walk past. Oh, this is a city village, and people here. This. <laughs> In all the Melaka Chitty family, family is very, uh, uh, community family is very important. Sometimes we wonder, you know, like if the matriarch is no longer there, you know, will that that connection still be there? I mean, I have to admit, like for me, my lineage ends here. I do not have, you know, uh, uh, someone to carry on my lineage. You know, so whatever I learn, stop here. They try as much as possible to teach their children. These are what. You know, ini kita punya kita punya culture. This is suku sakat. But do we maintain that connection? Maybe not. And then with people so dispersed, who is going to carry that on? So, but if not, this will be a a, a dying a, a clan, you know, kan? Because people tend to marry out, and then people people move out of the kampung to, for for better life. And then when they come back, it's like melawat. You know, you're in a catch-22 situation where you 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 want modernization and then you cannot keep up with this. You know, so sayang. We were Mal we were Malayans. We are now Malaysians. It's the same. I remember the first time I sang Negaraku outside of my country. I was going to cry. You know, I never knew I could feel like that about my country. I never had that experience before. So. Sometimes to be called pendatang and not it hurt. It really, really hurt because you don't understand our struggle. I was born on this bumi. It doesn't matter who it belongs to, but this bumi is my home. Like my mother always say, ini lah tempat tempat tu tu pada rahku. Ujang mas negeri orang, ujang batu negeri kita. Tak apa, aku ambil ujang batu. <laughs>